Hi guys, welcome to our session for today. Today I'm going to take you through uh, one of my shoulder sessions. Uh, obviously there's different variations, but this is one of my favorites that I like to do. To start it off, uh, I like to pre-fatigue the shoulders, as you, as you will see, doing side raises, bent over rows. I go into uh, shoulder presses, into the traps with upright rows and shrugs. So follow along, I'll try to explain as I go. Yeah, hope you enjoy it. So, obviously power band. Hook around the opposite foot, have a bit of a twist, strong stance. I hook it, instead of grabbing it, I hook it around, around my hand. From there, scapula set, chest open, control it down. Up, control it down. At the top, like to twist the arm, almost like you're tipping a cup. Get an extra squeeze on the, on the side laterals. Change to the other side, just loop it around, twist, hook around the arm again, strong stance, scapula set, up. From there, I'd like to move into uh, front raises. Same again, opposite leg. Look it round, you can grab it or you can just keep it up there. I like to grab it, up. Look around the opposite feet, the opposite side, around the hand, hook it, grab it, set the scapula, strong position, up. From there, we're going to bent over rows. Obviously, you can step into the theraband two feet or one foot. So, from there, I like to go through the theraband so I can grab it there, get a proper curl on it. Squeeze the top, slow back, stretch. Set the scapula. important to set your, your tummy as well so you don't put a lot of pressure on your low back, bend your knees. Last one. Now that the shoulder is nice and pre-fatigued, we're going to shoulder press. Today we're going for the standing one arm. So just hook around the leg, twist at the back. Nice strong position, set the scapula up, over. I try to get the shoulder through past the arm. Don't extend all the way to the top, keep the pressure on the shoulder. You can always pause for one or two seconds at the bottom. Again, as I always allude to, is there a stretch of fuss here at the bottom. There we change over. Exact same principle. Look around the foot, now in the back. Nice strong position, scapula set. Up, through, stretches the bottom. Not extending all the way to the top. Keep pressure on the shoulder.
from there, obviously with shoulders, you have to do traps. No more white pit stones within the here, within the power band. I have to give it a bit of a twist just to make it harder. With everything, turn it a little bit sideways. Set the scapulas first, chest open, from there, elbows up, to your chin. Get that big stretch at the bottom, let it pull you down, let gravity take hold. As you can see, I sort of adjust the mind so where I get the full range of motion where I feel the biggest stretch and the biggest pull on my, my traps, as well as the front of the shoulders. From there, we just go into normal shrugs, standard shrugs. Should be a staple of any shoulder, shoulder that's a routine. Step in it, both feet in. You can either grab the theraband or you can just put your hands through and then grab it. Gives it more security. So with shrugs, same thing. Pull the shoulders back, set the scapula. And as a lot of people make the mistake of doing this, just up and down, rolling the shoulders. In actual fact, it should be pulling the elbow slightly back. You squeeze the scapula in the, in the upper trap at the top. So squeeze, you grab it to take hold. Nice, big stretch at the, at the bottom. Three to five seconds. Nice and controlled. Big stretch to the bottom, last two reps. Stretch it, squeeze, get a good stretch. Last stretch, I like to do about five to ten seconds to get a good stretch and a good burn. All right, guys, so there's my, my normal shoulder routine, my favorite shoulder routine. Um, nice big pump, do three, three to five rounds if you want. You can incorporate it into a full body session, just shoulders, shoulders, with arms. Do as you like, but you know, as I as I said in my previous videos, I like to do giant sets, especially at home. Fatigue the shoulders, low rest, high intensity. You know, it works in the cardio a little bit, as well as a, as a massive pump that you get from there. So, hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe. See you next time.